You're insecure. Don't know what for. Hi guys, I'm Jasmine, and this look is I did this tutorial, and it is inspired by um, Kim Kardashian's Christmas card 2011. And I did this look because I'm um, entering a contest for Dulce Candy 87, and Dulce did this look um, a few months ago, a couple months ago actually, and it was inspired by Kim Kardashian the Christmas card, and. I want to say, Dulce Candy, I really, really admire you so much. Like, you, whenever I see one of your looks, I always want to do it on myself. Um, I love makeup, and I'm I'm happy that you had this contest, even if I don't win, because I always want to do tutorials, but I'm never, like, I always feel like I'm not good enough. So, I'm happy that I'm just getting this out there, and maybe it'll inspire me to do more videos. And that's the look. Okay, so I already got one eye done. Now I'm gonna show you how to do this eye. And there's gonna be this a Mary Kay eyeshadow. It's called Sunlight. And I'm just gonna take e um, Eco Tools. It's a big, dense, flat brush. And I'm just gonna take that color, the Sunlight color, and place it all over my lid. Blend it upwards a little bit. Now I'm going to take um, Eco Tools little, I guess, lid brush for a more precise shading. And I'm going to take this color by MAC. And it is called Honey Luster. Or Honey Lust. And it's just a really nice, um, like a pinky champagne golden shimmer color. And I'm just going to... Put that right in the inner corner. Now, I'm going to do the highlight color. And I'm just going to take, um, actually I'm going to take a different brush. I've had this brush forever. It's from Avon. It lost the long part of it. It just broke off, but the top part is still really good. That's why I keep using it. And I'm just going to take this quad by Lancome. And I'm going to take... This one down here is called Positive, and it's a matte um, beige color. I'm just going to put it right on the highlight. I'm going to take one of these um, sponge brushes, and, and most people throw them out, but I like to keep them because sometimes they do come in handy, like now. I'm going to take this quad again, this dark brown um, eyeshadow. I use it for everything. I love this eyeshadow so much. It's just a, um, a medium to dark brown. It's called Lezard, and it's matte. And I use it for so many things. I love this color. I'm just going to take the sponge brush. And it's an angled shape. So it's very, very good for um, drawing out the line for the crease. And that's just where... um. We're creating the smoky eye. Like, um, where is it? It's Eco Tools. Um, it's called a highlight brush, but I use it for blending and because it's very, um, that tapered brush. I'm going to take that same brown that we used and just going to blend everything out. Okay, now we're done with blending. And the next thing that we're going to do is do the cat eye and I have a lot of steps for this um, first I take another one of these sponge angled brushes and I'm gonna take this quad from Lancome and I'm gonna take this dark black color it's called statuesque and I'm just gonna use it to draw out the cat eye so it could help me when I'm using my gel liner I'm also gonna do it in the bottom too I'm going to take my eyeliner brush, and this is by Avon, and it's just a regular eyeliner brush. It's very um, thin and very um, good for doing precise lines, and I'm actually going to take Physicians Formulas, um, the Trio um, 
eyeliner is for blue eyes I think but I still got it because I, I like the colors it's brown blue and black I'm gonna take the black one and it has a little bit of like blue sparkles in it but it's the only black eyeliner I have eyeliner I have so I'm gonna have my eyeliner brush with water just because the um physicians formula gel eyeliner is very um dry and it dries up really fast when you're putting it on your eyes so it's better to work with when it's wet Think, does it look even? I think I'm done with the black eyeliner. Now we're going to take the same um, little spongy brush thing. I'm going to go back to that black eyeshadow from Lancome statue ask and just go over the um cat eye brush from Avon and we're just gonna go into that white eyeshadow and because I don't have a white eyeliner I'm just gonna wet my brush again and I'm gonna go into that white eyeshadow and I'm just gonna um line my waterline with this because I don't have a white eyeliner so and I'm gonna take my Revlon Grow Luscious and it's kind of old so it's getting a little clumpy but I'm still gonna use it okay now the face is gonna be really really easy I already applied my primer which is the Monistaff Chasing Gel I use it as a primer and I have a review on that so if you guys want to check it out you can go check it out and um the face is really really simple it's just foundation and bronzer basically um i'm gonna take my ame smart shade in medium and i remember i said i used to not like this stuff but it's because i was applying it with a brush and it wouldn't blend into my skin because it's supposed to just blend into your skin that's why i bought it because i hate matching my skin tone because it's always changing but this stuff you have to put it on your hands you have to blend it around and then you have to apply it on your i'm just gonna take my physician's formula um it's just a face powder and it's in the color bronze and I'm just going to take my Eco Tools powder brush and just put this to um, set my makeup. I'm already kind of bronzed but um, I'm going to use Bare Minerals Warmth, the bronzer right there. Um, I'm just going to use this to contour and this, this warmth is really really warm like it's like cocoa powder. I'm just going to use this um, blush brush from Eco Tools, but you can use it for bronzer too. I'm just going to uh, just gonna blend everything too. The most important thing now is the lips. I'm gonna take this lip liner, it's by Avon and it's in the color Wildberry. You can see that. I don't know. You're gonna focus, 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 focus. Anyways, just line your lips. Um this Lipstick by Mary Kay, and it is an apple berry. Everything is berry. And it's a beautiful berry color.
and it's nice and creamy and 